Oh, what's up guys and welcome back to another episode of the TCG Card Shop Simulator. This is episode 9. Um, first couple of episodes of Outs I'm recording this. It's been so nice to see how well the series is doing. Um, the shorts doing really well as well. I've seen the I've seen the channel get like 20 subs in a couple of days, which hasn't happened for a long time, which is just brilliant. So if you're watching this and you're liking the series so far, consider liking and subscribing. I'd appreciate it greatly. Today we are taking the money that we earned last episode. And we are spend, spend, spending. I think we ended up not far shy of three grand saved after the last three days. So we're going to go in. We're going to upgrade the size of the shop. We're going to get a new player table. All that good stuff. So that we have bolstered it out. Ready to reorganize the shop. And start to put our, our personality into the style of the shop. But without wasting any more time, let's get straight into it. Here we are back at cutscene cards on the morning of day 25. So before we let anyone in. We're going to do our price checks, then we're going to do our expansions, just so that we start this episode off right. Market 1010, 32.25. That is a big price jump on them boxes. Board game, how are we looking? We'll stick you at 47 still. 12.50, don't go down. We'll take it staying the same. 17. 17, it stays. 1450. I could probably squeeze a bit more out, but being lower price, pushing a bit more out, like has an even larger ne negative effect. If that makes sense because percentagely it's so much more. Probably push this to 2025, and I think I'm going to push it to next year. It's next year's problem. See, this dropped a little bit. Let's probably check every morning. 28. Oh, wait, what was it? Is it 28? Yeah, uh, we'll go 28.50 then. Um, 35 on the nose, we will absolutely try and get away with if we can. 15, a little bit of a downturn there. What about green? Ooh, 17. We'll get 50. Cleanser. Smelly boys still be smelly in. We'll just call that £10 even. 45 on the nose. 7 on the nose. Stick with 22 there. It's up a little bit, but not really enough to write home about. Oh, we can still check this here. Uh, 260, can't really go up on that yet. Oh my god, it's gone up more. Huge, huge news. Um, can I be asked to check the price for these? Oh, wait, it's only like two cards actually out at the minute. They've come down, which is kind of sad. They've gone up. Awesome. Right, so that is all of that stuff done. Now let's come into the My DIY. No, not My DIY. Wrong. Reno. We're going to do the first three expansions. We'll do first four expansions. Boom. And then we're going to buy another table. Um, play table. Oh, yes, of course you can. So we'll go ahead and do that now. Uh, where were we doing it before? I think we were down here before. Right, and move that for other stuff. There we go. We've got another table in. Um, we're not going to reorganize. I'm going to leave it a mess. Next episode is going to be the big reorganization. There we go. We've got an extra table now. Did I change the event like I said I was going to? Um, edit. I might save that. I might leave it at pauper for now. I think I said I wanted to get two more tables in, which after a reorganization, I'm certain I'll be able to do. But there we go. That is us open. Huge. I have no idea what stuff I've got over here. Deck boxes and stuff. Needs a collection book. That is one of the next licenses I'm inquiring into, sir. Just blow budget if you have it. Uh, we won't be able to the cards. Okay. Oh, smelly boy. You know what? You're in and you're out. 
I think he's spent 40 bread to be gone with you. Let's put ourselves here then. Oh my god, there's so many smelly boys. Um, open. Place. Starting deck boxes, which is nice. We've got to get back in the swing of it. We're not, we're not um, been on the game like in real life for a little while. Got to get, got to get going again. Got to get cooking. One, two, three, four. Two sixty-six. Wait. Um. Why set to duplicate still? I was okay. Cool. Just wanted to check. Sorry, my pen. I had to check a thing. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you, um, you enjoy them packs. So this is the new update that I did. Look, it's deck boxes and play mats now. And dude's got a comic book out by as well. How cool is that? Makes it so much more immersive. I love it. Very, very cool. Very, very cool update to make the world feel more alive. So what I might do is um reorganize where stuff goes. That's what we need to start thinking of while we're doing this episode. We need to work out where we want to reorganize stuff so that we know how we're doing it. Look, it looks so much cooler seeing these guys play on playmats. Yeah, it's horrific. Why can't I get a collection book? Because I don't have the license for it. Maybe we move the tables over here and create more space for tables because they're such good gunners. And then create like a corner of shelving here. And then we can put this um this in the centre here. Move this out a little bit and have some room for storage. How many times does that woman gonna say she needs a collection book? We don't have any. What does she expect me to do? Oh, we've not played bills yet, have we? Oh, I'm bad. Let's get them all paid. I assume our rent will go up with more um, square footage acquired because, you know, that's how the world works. Nine. Sixty. Dum, dum, dum. Um, dice we're doing mostly okay for. We also have some spare still, I believe. Yellow deck box, I think we sold a couple of today. Oh, we did. No, wrong way. Ah! Oh my god, they're taking the piss of this many customers already. Um, I'm just going to turn game audio up a little bit because it's uh, actually a little bit uncomfortably quiet. Oh, that's much better. Two cards and two books. What a chat. Does he realise the book's the same? Or is he one of them weirdos who looks for misprints? Okay, we are out of cards on the uh, table now. We should then um, deal with that. Market 10 10. Market 10 10. Is that actually right? Yeah, that's cool. Okay. 
Me, so, um, back opening at some point in the not too distant future. Chap and chap out. How many of these fuckers do I have? Loads. The answer is loads. Eighteen twenty four. Boom, go. Sorry, it'll be hard work until about five ish. At five, it dies down, and you just get more people who play. And at that point, we can start having a look at our stock requirements. Go out on a limb and say, right now, that we're going to need sleeves. Short changing change him an entire pound. And that is one note to Arsenal as well. See. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, boom. Boom, boom. Good stuff. Already back over it for a thousand. It's got to be a pretty good day so far. Might need to hire someone. Should I have a look at how much that costs? Costs 500 to hire them and then 50 quid a day. That's insane. And that's for like the shittest worker. I think I'd rather struggle by myself for a little bit longer. Red deck box uh, 28 50. Good price, you're damn right, it's good price. What a chad with the boxes. <laughs> Nearly five o'clock when it should start slowing down a little bit and allow me to um work out what stock I need. I'll have to hide that card in there. I feel like we've earned a lot of money today. Am I crazy? Okay. We're going to need two of the board games again. Boom. Add the card. Comics for fine four. Them dice for fine four. Blue dice. Do we have any blue dice? Which ones are you? I can't tell. You're the white dice. We don't need any more of them. But we do need some blue and some red. Accessories. Blue and red deck boxes we need some red red deck boxes plans are okay for we need some sleeves i think that's actually it at the minute so once I've worked out how much that is, we might treat ourselves to some packs. Because we've had such a good day.
Fil tutar. Aş probably put the more cards out. Six nine pence per card is not a bad spot, I've got to be honest. Just mass selling individual cards though, it just feels weird. Oh no, I'm not giving it that much Christ. Okay, we're getting a late spree of packs here. It's crazy that we're now like we're considering a 60 pence card as like really really low and cheap now. When for a while that was like the highest card we had dupes of. I really love this update to there being the playmats and stuff though. And like you see, like you can't see them here because they there isn't any. But like some customers had like deck boxes, like these guys, and like some will have comics as well. And apparently it's only the stuff that you have licenses for as well. But I just think that's really fucking cool update to make the shop feel more alive. Oh my god! Okay, so we're definitely gonna need to buy some more boost boxes just because we've sold a few. Why the death here? I think. Fuck not, bitch. Basically, I'm taking on the shelf now. Um, right. So yes, I'm gonna want one of you, and we're gonna buy one of you, one of you, and one of you, and that'll be ours to kind of open whenever we want to. Some of it will be for shelves, but I will open. I'm going to open at least eight from every thing. So, a quarter. And it will really be good. Bear in mind how much we spent on upgrades, though. Like, to finish the balance for this much money is insane. The extra tables have clearly already started to pay dividends. I just got to let these customers finish up. Um, I am just going to go ahead and place these orders now, though, so that I can start putting them away whenever it makes sense. Awesome. Oh, fuck it. We're going to just go turn the light on. Fuck the electricity bill. I just want to be able to see what the part's going on more easily. We're not um, quite on that level of cost cutting at the minute, so we'll live with it. Honestly, until we reorganise the shop, We're going to use this little spot behind as a nice little spot to um, store crap. I think this... Oh my... We have extra common books, that's not from. 10, 5, 1. Yeah, cheers, pal. Right, that should be everyone now. We're going to be smart here. Maybe this is like kind of how we organize it anyway. Because you can get some racking which is designed for um, which is designed for this exact idea. Um, this racking, my DIY. why. Small warehouse shelf. Maybe we hide one limb back here. Um, that can just stay there for a second. We'll sort the packs in a minute. Let's sort everything else out first. Yeah, so it's a decent amount, I understand. I just like being able to sell comic books, I've got to be honest. Makes me feel good. The only thing we're going to leave near us is the cleanser, and that's just because we need it handy. We didn't sell any of these fireboxes, which is starting to grate on me slightly. And what about these? Awesome. 
Right. Bring this in. And let's, let's do what we're going to do here. Right. First off. Fill up shelf. Put down. Take out as many as I can hold. Open them. Didn't see the value of any of these cards so far. 320 right at the end there. Not a bad pack. We take it. Another decent pack. 628. That's actually really nice. Good stuff. 336. Oh, that's a really good pack. What the fuck? Not a good pack. Value. Boom. Three pound. Nothing major. Next up, these boys. Let's see what we're getting these. Slightly better packs in theory, but we've kind of been destroying the value. That's a pretty cool card. Lots of new cards, so because we just haven't had many of these packs. So we're not going to get any dupes in these. Fortunately, these packs value at like an all-time low, so. Oh, that's a really cool card. EX Mamog. Let's go. Ooh. So, yeah, these packs of value are at an all time low, so opening these like is basically guaranteed profit. Oh, my goodness. Just multiple four, five pound cards. Yeah, they're new, so we can't resell them, but it's fine. Who cares? Cool. Nice. Welcome, 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 Millie. Thank you for the follow. Nice, Mintos, six pound five. I get proper trapped into just um, doing that loop, don't I? These packs have technically been profitable, but unfortunately, a lot of the good value cards have been new, so we're probably not going to be able to realize any of that value. But still, always fun to open packs. Goodbye. And then the big boys. Not as many of these to go on the shelf because these packs are truly for the big boys, but we can still treat ourselves to a few. Okay. Big box, no whammies. Come on. Horrific. Ooh, that's a cool card. Other than that, mid. It's called the Midwest because every single thing in it is mid. I mean, oh, that's cool. Ooh, oh, see that card looks so much better than three fifty nine. But I know I don't buy cards, but I'd spend more money on a card that looks that cool. Oh my goodness, the second one. Again, first edition four, but it's only worth 580. How does that make sense?
Okay, these packs are not been as good as I was hoping. Ooh, that's a cool looking card. Oh my goodness, another one. Ooh, 24 pound, that's more like it. Let's go, we'd love to see it. 588 dupe as well. That pack wasn't great, but profit, Plus all dupes. So you'd be able to add what like 20% onto that. Eek. That was a really cool pack. And that is all them. Right. That is all of that. Da done. Right, so let's turn the light off and end the day. Yeah, look, we've got an extra 20 visitors today. How much have we earned from game earning? Nearly double interesting bearing in mind you take the 200 uh, not 200 the two grand of upgrade costs we made a profit of 500 uh, 500 today which is really good let's um go in and pay our bills yeah our rent has gone up so that's fine which means our daily operating is a bit higher not the end of the world um 3 20 uh, no 20, 32 per box now oh that's come down a bit but it's fine comics up same 17 pounds yeah they can stay at 17 pounds yeah they can stay at 14 5 17 50 yeah these don't fluctuate nearly as much, which is not a bad thing, just so we're clear. These fluctuate the most. And it always seems to be in the wrong direction. Go on. At least not jumped off the Bryce course, that hasn't. That'd be too good for me. We can, we can keep that seven and get away with it, I think. Ooh, two, 280. 280. What's good, Emerson? How you doing, bud? Oh my god, these have gone up again. Back to back days of increase, 420. The blazer. <laughs> See, chat, I'm cool. Um, still 22 on these. Still 10 flat on these, which is, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, 1750, all good. 2850, it's gone down a little. Boxes have taken a beating overnight, which is crazy. Um, 2075, can probably get away with. Awesome, that's all them. Get some cards out. Nice, Mark 1010. Mark it 1010. Market and turn. We got some good value cards on sale, which is where we are always want to be. There we go. Everything's good to go. Open up store. No, not open up store. For sake. Smiley boy's going to come straight in here. Let's go, let's make some bread. Nice. Individual card. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Are you going straight here? Okay. Um, let's go. Right, next card up. Market 1010, that's up to 407, Christ. The, um, the 1010 doesn't seem like a lot of the small cars, but when you get a big card, it doesn't buy Jove add value. 3, 26. Have a good day, sir. Here we are. We shouldn't realistically have to order much, if any, stock today, which is good. It'll just be grab stock and put it out. My day was really good, thank you, Emerson. Is it Emerson or Jose? Uh, just so I make sure I'm addressing you correctly. 
Or she'd prefer to go buy something else that's obviously appropriate. I'm more than happy to do that. My day's good, thanks. Hope yours was too. Boom, 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 boom. I get some review about this game, so I saw your stream. Duh, 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 duh. Uh, so now I should give a review about this game because I'm interested in playing it. I mean, I can give you a short one. I am working on a video for my YouTube channel where I do a review for that. So if you're interested in seeing a more in depth review, uh, if you type exclamation mark YouTube and go and sub over there, there will be a video up there reviewing the game relatively soon. Um, but overall, yeah, the game's a lot of fun. I'm enjoying it a lot. It's um, it's not my usual kind of game. I took a chance on it, and I've enjoyed it a lot. It's fun managing all these different things. It's fun playing a game where you feel rewarded for optimizing your strategies and stuff. So it's definitely something, that if it seems like it would interest you, it probably will. This update with all the boxes and the playing mats and stuff is so cool. I wonder if changing the meta or the, the game that's being run affects what gets shown not that much or if it's just kind of randomly generated at the minute uh nine twenty five two cards one two three four boom, boom. Um, one, one. I'll just get some more cards out before I forget. Hi, Rob. So, so, so you can't turn up to work, but you can go around and see you. See how it is, Robert. Um, not every day, Emerson. Um, normally Tuesdays and Wednesdays, the occasional weekend stream. Yeah, oh my goodness, 49.75 by card. Quick, someone grab his card details. Making good money here. Nice profitable day. No, I don't have a YouTube, uh, a Discord server at the minute. But if you put um, notifications on on Twitch, you'll get a notification anytime I go live. Or if you do exclamation mark YouTube and subscribe over there, um, and turn post notifications on, you'll find out when I'm live as well. Because I stream to both Twitch and YouTube at the same time. You get to see them once a year, yeah, and. Um, I am on Instagram, but I don't really post much um, content to Instagram. Um, I'm on TikTok. I'm on YouTube. I'm on Twitch. Um, I post a fair bit on Twitter, but I'm not trying to make Twitter a platform I particularly post to, but I do post a lot on there. I also have a podcast. If you exclamation mark socials, um, you'll find my link tree. I'm not going to give out my Insta username. There you go. There's my link tree. Oh, it doesn't appear to have come up in the Twitch chat, which is weird, but there you go. There's my link tree. You can find everything on there. Boom. That was three weeks ago. So you get seen once. Wait, so how am I saying hi to Rob then? If you just spotted that he's in the chat, did he say something that got himself timed out briefly? Like a fool. Oh my goodness, there's so much going on. There's people talking to me, there's there's customers waiting. It's only two o'clock, we made a fortune today, and people are going to keep buying deck boxes. We're going to keep making a fortune, Christ alive. 96? 
I'll go here. I've been reliably informed by people who would never lie to me. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, that I look good on the big screen. I cannot confirm. But I've been told on numerous occasions. But just hearing that I'm out on the big TV, I just kind of want to do like a one of them like really... I'm not going to say the word I want to say because it feels dirty. I just want to do one of them really internet funny loud moans. We'll just say that instead. Yeah, this is this is episode nine we're recording at the minute. Um, at the minute, Colin. Episode three, as it was recorded, goes out tomorrow. I see that stinky fucker in the background. I'm coming for him. Balls. Imagine going to play a local shop and the shopkeeper jumps on the table to spray someone. Wah, 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 bam. Uh, 60. Oh my goodness, 65. 65.50, come on. Can I get a higher? He's gone deathly silent in the other room. I don't know if anyone's just heard that and is wondering what the fuck's going on. Um, right, we're good. You gonna let me? Oh, is there something that lets me put a shower in to de, de stinkify the people that come in? Cards, 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 cards. Boots and cards and boots and cards. Oh my god, that cod's gone up 12 pence since I last sold it. Stole it. Yeah, I'm just selling stolen cards. What? You never know that you could do what, Colin? Spray the dirty fucks or jump up on the tables? Shane Pete Wing not in your repeated oh yeah and didn't know it was you for fuck's sake. Pete might be the exception to the rule about scousers, but don't tell him I said that. What's plans about Twitch in future you have? Um I mean I'm just gonna keep streaming regularly. Hopefully we can grow it. I didn't spend a lot of time on Twitch because I focus more on the YouTube side. Um, but now that it's easy to do both at the same time, I'm doing both at the same time. And hopefully, um, hopefully it turns into something. But if not, we'll just keep having fun with it. The only one that I take um, kind of a professional level of seriously is the podcast with Hori. And that purely because it's not just mine. So I have a responsibility to him to always try my best over there. Over here, I'm just kind of trying to do my own thing. Keep it fun, light, and breezy, and do the stuff I want to do. Oh my god. Um, 25. Thank god I can do mental mass quickly. What do people who have no number skills do on this game? Yeah, I've already been informed by a, another friend that it's starting to steal their life already. Okay, that is basically I'm stepping on the show. Awesome. See, I knew these tables would be full. I fucking knew it. It's so worth getting extra tables. We're gonna we're gonna try and go up, I reckon. I reckon we try and go up to four tables, maybe even five. More tables, more money. Just It's literally a one-to-one -one correlation because of the way the game works. 
you could make so much money if you just went tables all over. Emerson, you're going to stop right there. One sec. We're going to pause the game so that I know how to edit this out. Emerson, you're going to stop right there. One of the first things you do when you get into any Twitch channel is you have to agree to the rules of the chat. And one of my first rules, or one of my only rules, there is literally not many, is make sure that you're not going to solicit. I've read this script that you're going through a million times. Stop trying to sell me graphics. One of my best friends is a graphic designer. If I need anything, I will go to them. Stop it. It's a joke. Come on. I'm so sick and tired of being polite to people who come in and solicit when they know they shouldn't. It's a joke. Come on. Lock in. Boom, 42 quid, let's go. Oh my god, I'm out of cards again. Cards are going so fast. Oh, th this Don just bought through. I was about to say, I could have sworn I had some cards a minute ago. Rob. You know you're not allowed to be in the channel being horny. You have a wife. I will tell your wife what you're saying in my channel. I will tell her that you're going on to attractive people's live streams. Being weird. I'll tell her that. I won't add any context. The, the cards are literally going... I'm selling like the cheapest, most dog shit cards ever. And they are still going faster than I can replenish them at this point. We done? We good? Shop's gonna be closed in a few minutes. We can get some cards out. Quick. Quick. I don't know why. They're being 10 slots and they're and them not always all being full drives me up the wall. Even though it's a good thing because it means we're selling cards. It does my head in. Don't know what he just said. Was he complaining about me spraying him? If he didn't want to be sprayed, he shouldn't stink like shit. Oh my goodness. Sleeves for the lady. No, we're not trying to overdrive like that. Christ. Yeah. 1, 2, 3, 50, 10. I also missed something there. Avit. Aviki, thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome to the channel. Oh my god, how much has this dude spent? 115 quid 89. What's he bought here? Four comics, deck box, cleanser, three epic packs, a card, dice. This guy has just got into um playing. He's just bought like a starter kit. That's crazy. Why does nothing happen when you spam love hearts? I have not got a clue, Rob. Maybe something is happening and I just can't see it. Oh, on the on the built-in YouTube chat, I can see it. But I use a third-party chat so that I can see both Twitch and YouTube at the same time. That would be why. But it's not, it's not TikTok. You're degenerate. I say that. If I had better internet, I would also be live on TikTok. But it just cannot currently support that bandwidth. My goodness. We are criminally low on decent cards. Oh, we've got 10 of these. That's fine. That was 70, 70 a pop. That's 7 quid's worth of cards. Quick mess. Right. We, don't, we shouldn't need to buy any stock here. But we probably need... Oh, wait, which one's you? No, wrong one. Oh. Which one are you? I should probably need to buy some white here. I need to buy some more red boxes and some more green boxes. 
That was me thinking, oh, I don't need to buy much here. Wrong. Wrong, wrong, wrong. If you are watching over on YouTube, make sure you like and subscribe. It is completely free, doesn't cost a penny, and it helps out a bunch. If you're watching on Twitch, make sure you're followed. Make sure you're ringing that bell to find your way back here more easily in the future. Womp womp. Du, 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 du. One pack left. Okay, well, you know the rules, boys. There's one pack left. Mine. Three, nine, five. Profit. 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 So much profit. Worth it. We've made an insane amount of money today. Better watching on TV than through a window. Bonk! Straight to horny jail. Do not pass go. Do not collect £200. One pound. Oh my god, seven quid. Let's go. And it's a dupe as well. We get to sell that bad boy. 359. Oh my goodness. That's a huge pack. Can you believe how much just left that sitting in a box? Diabolical. Du, 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 du. So leaves. Okay, we need some sleeves as well. We have ha we have had to do a surprisingly large restock here. Okay, we need booster pack. We need sleeves. We need green, red, green, red. That's it. Boom. It's crazy that you're talking like this, Rob, when we literally have a HR meeting in a couple of weeks about zero harm, and we're literally in the same course together. So if anyone, if they ask for any examples, you're getting thrown under the bus, pal. I'm telling you that now. In fact, I'm going to save your chat logs. i to finally get this dealt with once and for all. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's Ian and Edmund's doing it, though. I shouldn't have full named him. Oh, well. Um, right. That is the end of the day. Boom. More customers again. Look just at the amount of money. Game earnings up another 90 quid. We spent 400 quid on supplies and we still made, yeah, look, made that's literally a you know, achievement to make a thousand in a day. Huge day. And this is the last hour. Oh, these fucking prices now. Market 1010. Oh my god, these have gone up again. Buh, buh, buh. 17, 14, 15. Mm. Like that. All I'm saying is, you guys that are complaining that we don't play games together anymore, COD is on Game Pass. We could play zombies together very easily. Like, actually, insanely easily. Think about it. Consider it. Oh my god, these packs bouncing up. Back. So. This still hasn't dropped as well, which is great news. These going up? Oh my god, they are. Will I ever need to restock these things, do you think? You'd have more fun than Jack with players does playing golf with friends. And I always have time in my schedule, Rob, if people don't dilly dally and they make what they want to do clear. I just don't have time to corral you all like children. 
Um, let's open it up. Oh no, smelly fuck is going to be the first customer through the door. What terrible stock today. Yeah, I, I, the customers were complaining that I didn't have any playmats in stock. Then they've just like literally not bought any. I think I bought two boxes ever and that's the second box. I guess not that many people need loads of playmats. What did he say about price? Fair price for basic gold pack. Oh, oh my god, this guy has just spent some money. Oh, and exact change. What go? 50 quid exact money. What a start to the day. Oh, that reminds me actually. Starting the day. We've almost, just from the expansion, by the way, and the extra table. We're almost back to more money than we had to do the expansion. Just because of the extra money it's allowed us to generate. I have found that dice fly off the shelf. I have to restock dice basically every day. They kind of go out in pairs. Like the white and the black are together and the blue and the red I think it is. They get, um, they get sold together. As a general rule, I'm restocking them every day. It, maybe you're pricing them too high? I don't know. Maybe you just got bad RNG, I don't know. If the customers could be like RNG'd for a certain thing. Maybe that's why my playmats don't do very well. Let's get some cards out. No, I have, I have better value cards than that now. What are we doing? Um, open this. F. Duplicates. Yeah, knew it. Selling a single card for £8 is diabolical, by the way. There are people who spend this kind of money in real life on card games, and I don't get it. I spend a lot of money on dumb shit. Oh, Christ. Who's, who, who's let the Scouser in it? Who gave the Scousers internet? Yeah, I blame Robozar. One sec, Colin, what do you mean you're selling everything under market value? Colin, I might be about to blow your mind here, unless I've misunderstood what you said. Everything's under market value. This mark, do you mean the market price? Mate, you want to make loads more money? Market, 10, 10, round down to the nearest bunch, 25. For this, and then for cards, market, plus 10, plus 10. Promise you, it will sell. Benjamins? You want a holiday in America, Pete? Fucking Benjamins. I've been watching too many of these crime films in America. Oh my god, have a shower, pal. You stink. Sweet, yeah, that. 110. Oh six! Wow! 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 Huge! Big! Big bucks! Fourteen fifty. Colin, you're playing a mugs game, mate. There's so much more money to be made. You're leaving so much money on the table. You see the speed at which my stock is flying, and I've just showed you my rule how I market literally everything. You're, li you're literally leaving around 20% of the money you're making daily on the floor. You're a mad lad. Oh, 
Unless you're doing like some kind of challenge run where you're like trying to make the majority of your money from individual cards. But if you increase in profit margins, you can open more packs. You can keep more packs for yourself. Think about it like that. 541. Can I get a second to get some cards out? For the love of all that is holy. This woman spent so long to pay one, there was nothing on it, she'd definitely go grab one. Imagine walking, yeah, she skipped the first two of the exact same card, and then when I put the third one down that was the exact same, she was like, oh, I guess this is all he has, I better grab one. I literally can't replenish the cards fast enough at this point. It's actually a problem. I have no idea how much I stay on top of these cards at this point. The words got out about my awesome collection of cards that I always have for sale. And now people just come in all hours buying cards. It's impossible to maintain. Staff are useless, they'll slow me down, they don't understand my system. I see that smelly fuck over there and I'm gonna go and get him. God, we've finally got more cards on the table than empty spots. Look nice to be alive. We are making some serious fucking dosh today, ladies and gentlemen. Holy hell. You reckon, Pete? Start making my own forgeries of these tickets, yeah? Might have a little tinker in the workshop, see what we can do. Oof! Are we... Deep breath moment? I see you, funny fucker. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh! That was an intense morning. What have we got around here? We got room for some blues. Oh, for fuck's sake. These people, man. Do I look like I've found shake reviews? Christ alive! Reviews 4.72. People are thrilled with the shop. They're having the time of their in lives. I feel like Pete is one of them dudes the um just talks fast in a funny accent because you know the scout accent is fucking ridiculous they just have to be different i think the reason our reviews were kind of stuck at um 4.3 was because we were getting like X amount of dissatisfied customers no matter what and that's a higher percentage but the, the amount of dissatisfied customers hasn't really changed but we're getting like 20 to 30 customers more per day now so it's just causing it to swing around <laughs> see he has to be special so much that he's typing in his accent it's deranged behaviour Oh, Christ alive, didn't mean to do that. 
Right. That's supposed to be the white deck dice boxes, which we don't have anymore. Oh, crikey. Not sold any of them today, that's fine. I think we've sold some of these, yeah, we have. Oh, not enough. Oh my god, the queue's massive. Fucking Matthew Murdoch looking head ass. Right. Can you be my security guard, Pete? Now that is a job I'd actually hire you for, Pete. Beautiful. We good? See, now you're thinking like someone playing a game where it's about min-maxing, Colin. How much can I milk these guys for? Now, I hate capitalism. I despise capitalism more than more than more than most. In a video game, I get I get to I get to let that innate human feeling of oh money 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 out in a safe and controlled way. That's what it's all about. Right, what the fuck do I need more of? Oh, black dice, white dice, uh, or it's yellow in it. No, it's white. Red. We are just out of dice. Um, yellow deck boxes. We need card box. I'm going to order some more cleanser. And that is it for now, I think. Deep breath. You're not seeing the kind of money we're moving through here, Pete. We made like two grand today alone. 60 million down the drain. Can I have at schools again? Na 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 na. We're here. Oh. It's crazy that there's seven people in the YouTube chat right now, yet the stream only has two likes. You're not you're not you're not all doing me dirty like that, surely. Cost you nothing to tell about your guy. <laughs> Let's all laugh at this guy, he doesn't have a play mat. <laughs> Nerd. Hello. Okay, it's nine o'clock now. Customers will start filtering out. Let me um Stop ordering. Eight hundred quid on stop. And we still got two thousand eight hundred just chilling in the bank. Insanity. Yeah, you keep walking by. It's not a bastard. Oh my god, it burns! See, there's still one left on the shelf. So, you know what that means, chat? <laughs> it means we get one for ourselves. Just a little treat. We're working so hard today while well, the customers have been flowing. No, you cannot have an advance, Pete. Any chance you guys fucking off? No, oh, okay. I mean, you could have finished the game, but thank you. All right, let's open some packs. Big bucks, no whammies. Big bucks, no whammies. 238. Two... I mean, it covers its own cost, but it's kind of mid. Once again, I think it's barely... Yeah, it's going to cover its cost, but it's not exactly good, is it? I mean, profit. Nothing, nothing blowing me away. They give me all them fancy ghost cards that are like 
in grand or whatever. Any any danger of a big card? Come on. Come on, you know you want to. <laughs> These packs are like look at that, 155. Christ. Hey, now we're talking. Seven quid. 130. I mean, it's a new card, so I don't even get the money from that. Right. Well, that's us done then. Everything's restocked. Oh. Boom. Look at that. Profit 660 quid today after spending 900 on supplies and all. That revenue is tasty. Need to add a couple more tables in here for sure just to really bolster that like free money. Um, for sure, for sure. Because we're, I mean, just from the tables alone, we're earning the value of two tables a day at the minute, which is um, definitely worth compounding and that was episode nine of the tcg card shop simulator taking them a couple of days to earn all that money to, to upgrade the shop clearly paid its dividends we're earning more money than ever and we've really got to capitalize on that so next episode is going to be a shorter one we're going to rearrange the shop we're going to see if we can get some new licenses in and some new stock in so that we can really try and get the most out of this shop and this space see you next time